It really does. Treasures album sold 100,000 units in the very first week. She is number one on Billboard, iTunes, and all ancillary streaming services. Great job, everyone. Do you have something you want to add, Andre? Actually, I do. Anybody see Billboard this morning? And I quote, a few bops, but otherwise a paint by the numbers Tiana 2.0. Who cares? Does Empire have anything new? Tiana 2.0 is not something to applaud. Our music needs to have staying power, and if every record sounds like the last one, Treasure's next album is gonna go wood. Excuse me, Bob. We need a creative refresh. That's why I'm introducing Empire Raw, a musical event to showcase our company's new vision and sound. So you want to do Unplugged? Do you also have a time machine to take us back to 1998? <laughs> I'm not talking about scented candles and acoustic guitars, Pop. I'm asking each and every one of you to dig deep. Expose those parts of yourself you've always tried to hide. That's where the power of our artistry lies. You do that, I guarantee I win you more aces than Empire's ever received before. Unfortunately, the aces are nominating in less than two weeks, so what you're asking is impossible. I believe in our team. We can pull it off. Okay, I'm going to need to ask everyone to leave the room for a second so my son and I can talk. Stay right where you are. Anything you have to say to me, say it in front of them. All right. That's it. You've screwed up twice. You've cost us Tiana, and you almost derailed Treasure's rollout. You are out as CEO. I am retaking the reins. You don't have the authority to remove me as CEO. Empire shares are everywhere, and you're no longer the majority owner. But since you're a minority stakeholder, I'm happy to get you a table. It's VIPs only, but I'm sure I can pull some strings. Anything for you, Pop.